Now we just hope that no one turns around the corner and uh, side swipes the van off. I'm going to get squashed by my own van and pretty much day one into van. Um, the van build that wouldn't be ideal, my friends. Tell you good before you kick off, make sure you like the video, share, subscribe. If you're new around here, we're converting our 2019 CR35 140 long wheelbase uh, van, our craft van into a camper van. Morning, everyone, how's it going? Welcome back to the channel as always. Before we kick off, uh, make sure you drop a like and subscribe. Of course, I'll be back today, my friends. It's the day we've got young Thomas filming behind the camera right now. I've come and picked up our car and we've come to um, a little cove where our new van has been delivered. So it's super exciting. There it is. There it is. There it is. Ta da! Well done, mate. This video is going off. Ugh, after ah, that was like old man sounds. After our eventful time, time trying to park yesterday, we ended up and managed to find like a parking space down this road. We did actually have um, a permit down at Oxen Cove or something, but oh, like honestly, there was nowhere to park. The traffic warden was down there, and he says because the van's a long wheelbase, if it slightly overhangs, you're gonna have to pay um, uh, for like an extra parking space. So I'm gonna ticket you, and I was like, oh my god. So I've been home. Got loads of stuff all dumped on the ground because today, my friends, it's Happy New Chair Day. Now, I know long term we have to take up the floor. We brought the windows, although they didn't have a sliding one for this one. So the driver's side, they didn't have a sliding one. We brought it for, from Trade Glass UK, I think it was. So waiting on a window there. We've got a sliding one to go in the passenger side and two universal ones to go here because this will be a dinette eventually. So. So that'll be cool when it's a dinette. And also one's uh, to quit in the back. But we are um, halfway through maybe, let's have a sit down, um, moving house to get a place, a garage. Because obviously we're gonna need to use power tools and rather than buy something like a jackery or something like that, we don't wanna be just stuck up the middle of the road with generators running absolutely annoying all the neighbors. Because it's one of these well-to-do places, you know. It's one of these well-to-do places. So it's down my friends, let's crack on, let's fit that seat. Ingredients for this install of our chair is a 10 mil bit that goes through metal some uh m10 these are 110 volts so far too long but these are only temporary we'll have to uh this is all i have we'll have to bend these over uh and then do a hole 10 mil hole through all of this and then fix it underneath this is again only temporary literally temporary but it just saves you bolting it directly the chair underneath to the bottom of the van which is quite thin uh, and then we also have some washers Mill, that's it both sides i've also found these these are from the old van the old build m10 spring washer so we're going to whack those on as well we also have some headache tablets some plasters <laughs> Careful don't get run over. Hello. Okay. Let's see where we are. There we are. Okay. Now we just hope that no one turns around the corner and uh, side swipes the van off. I'm going to get squashed by my own van. And pretty much day one into van, um, the van build, that wouldn't be ideal, my friends. But trust me, I could see these. So this is underneath the 2019 Craft Day, if you haven't seen before. There's nothing there, literally nothing there, look. Someone's gone through there, look, you see over there? Someone's gone through there with two little screws where they put the flooring in, so they haven't been too bothered about it either. My right, friends, it's going okay so far, man, it's going okay. No hiccups. Uh, now we're going to uh, fabricate our... Uh, um, brackets these are temporary okay they're gonna last 
couple of weeks, but they will do what it's meant to do, okay? They will spread the weight of the chair underneath the van so that he's gonna sit under. So if there is an accident, it'll pull on the underneath of the van. You're not relying on just something with the diameter of that underneath the van, so that's cool, okay? So let's fabricate our, um, like, things. Obviously wear safety goggles uh, and protective handwear, okay, and use a vice in your own garage. I haven't got a garage, we have the side of the road. I'm terribly sorry about that. So I've had to come home because I've got no battery left. I can't draw the last hole and I can't get the lock tight out properly. But that's okay. These things happen, you know, we have to go with the flow. Here's our lovely view walking home. Oh, this is why I need a garage. My friends is about a seven minute walk to the van. Straight through. Okay, some tricky ones as well. Quite tricky. Very tricky. In fact, they're all really tricky. So at the minute, we're just chilling. We've got a uh, croissant because there's a bin truck outside uh, and I don't want to lie under the van and get my leg run over. Yeah, the bin truck. Yeah, I don't, I don't want to do that. Don't want to do that at the minute. It's just so many eggs. This is a side note as I'm sat here. Right, I'm generally just sat here. Car's going past. And it's peaceful as hell. It's genuinely peaceful. You know, like van life, people are going about van life and, and, you know, living, spending time in vans by the side of the road and, you know, being free. It's actually really peaceful, I'm not joking. We're just on like some road. That's a view. It's really calming not to have the stuff, you know, the stuff in your house. It's pretty really calming not to have all that stuff and, you know, that'll be a job for the future. We're gonna have a, yeah, roof light there, but I think we're almost gonna go for a pop top on top. A pop top and then a back little window, a dinette area, and either side on top of the roofs up there, either side, we're gonna have um, a roof deck. Uh, I can't wait, man, I'm really excited. Okay, it's enough of that croissant talk, let's go. Back to the van guys, hope you're good. Okay, so last night we took some bolts out of the van, had to go home. I've got two little helpers today. One's uh, one Hi. over there. Uh, we cut the bolts a little bit shorter, so there's not so much sticking through. So we can use the socket, which I had to go home and get. Socket, and there it is. <laughs> there, there we go. Okay, but that goes in there. Um, we've got to take another one of the uh, plates out underneath the van and put that one in. So let's crack on my friends, get this thing finally in. So here we are, super light today. There's like everyone doing their work. So we've cut the bolt down short just so I can get my um, wrench up there, a little socket, and there's another one up there, which you can just see, which you can have a fiddle about in, in a minute, trying to get that on, so. Okay, let's crack on my friends. Now it's gotta be shorter and changed as well. And it's gonna have that plate put on instead. Okay. Okay, that one's took some getting on, but it did go on. And there's the other one in. Nice. So I've replaced it with a shorter bolt. A lock tight. There's a split. Is it a split washer on there as well? So that's better than the longer one. So that's good. And we just got our little friend up there to tackle. So that's going to be a bit tricky. Is it Thomas? Because <laughs> <laughs> I actually brought him up to do schoolwork, but he had to help poke through the little uh, the little bowl up there. So, so there we go. One, two, three, and four. It's okay. So you want to give it the wobble test? Yep. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 
Little man's in the front. Hey. There we go, my friends. All in, all fixed. Lock tightened up. Good as gold. Happy new chair. Next up, my friends, is universal windows at the back and the opening side window. But for now, as always, if you enjoyed the video, make sure you give it a like down below. Leave a like, share, and subscribe back uh, for more of these videos. Of course, I'll be back. Now, van life conversion. Bye. Bye.